In today's tutorial, I'll teach you how to add an interactive 3D animation to your design using Figma and few other tools. Let's get started. Hi everyone, this is Harpy Designs. Thank you for joining back. Before jumping into the full-fledged tutorial, let's talk about why we should use 3D animations in our designs. Actually, 3D animations create a visually uh, engaging website for our users. Also, it helps uh, for the user to know the functionality of the website or the application while creating a memorable experience for them. Without wasting any time, let's jump into the tutorial. Don't worry, I'll make it very simple for you guys. Let's get the basics first. Okay, so we'll start with the tool called sepline.com. If you know uh, if you know this tool, I'm sure you know a lot of stuff, uh, stuff about this tool. You just go to the sepline.com. Uh, we'll go right here. So you can just log in. I have already logged in. And uh, in the community tab, you can search or you can uh, explore whatever you like. You go to the community. There are so many 3D assets available which are totally free in fact. See, all these things. These are totally free. You just keep on scrolling. It will give you a lot of stuff. I have chose, uh, chosen this uh, uh, droid here. This is by Ella. And it's a really good one. A huge shout out to this developer or the 3D creator. Right. Once you just remix it, so it opens into your own uh, uh, this thing environment where you can edit your stuff. So once you open it, you click it, you can add uh, different states uh, and you can add the events to that. Uh, so initially it never came with the events. So you just click on the events, you click on start. There is look at, look at cursor, align with the camera, all will leave everything as is. So how it will be working is when you play it, wherever my camera looks, it will keep on looking on that. Nice, right? So there are a lot of other functions also. We will not jump into that as this tutorial is all about how we can use our 3D assets inside the Figma. Right? So we will jump into that. So right right now we have this droid here. So let's, it, let's leave it right here for a moment and move to the Figma. In the Figma, I will have MacBook 14 Pro as usual. And uh, let me create something here. <coughs> Okay, we'll add a rectangle. I'll make it a little small, I guess. This much uh, is fine, yeah. 30 pixel. Okay, I have the colors. Okay, let's do the gradient thing. This one will be this. This I'll take this one. Sorted. Okay, uh, I always like my gradients in the diagonal form. So we'll do the diagonal form only. Okay, so I have already created uh, these little components here. I'll be dragging all of them here. Oh, what happened? And this one here. Let's align, align them very quickly. Uh, these things, uh, this logo, I always take them from the website called logoipsum.com. I always use my dummy logos from the website. Uh, if you have seen my previous videos, you would have known that already. So we have designed our design already there. Now all we need is our 3D asset to be here. Okay. So let's copy this rectangle as is. Okay. And uh, before we do anything, let's go to the supply and do the export thing. Then. Uh, update public URL because I'm using the existing which I'm already creating otherwise you can just create a public URL once it's created then just copy embedded code go to your design click on the rectangle the first one you are choosing using click on your plugins this thing remember in the previous video I told you this is marvelous <laughs> so click here go to the anima uh, let it load it takes a little time to load I have logged in all my accounts already so if you guys are already using those plugins or those uh, uh, things then websites then you must be having the account already if you are new to them then you'll have to go to the website and create the accounts and then you can do that right okay so again for the anima I have already created my account so it's just I need to add uh, a code here okay so uh, once you are or if you are not logged in, it's going to ask you to log in. You click on the login, it takes you to the browser website, you and enter your everything stuff, then it redirects direct you back to the uh, this plugin, Anima plugin, and you'll see all these options here. So, uh, no, nothing fancy, we'll talk about all these options maybe in uh, some other tutorial. Right now, we'll be doing the 3D only. So, click on the embed code, the paste the code which you took from uh, sapline.com, and then click on save. Okay, let's click on uh, sync, then click on HTML, give it a while, it's going to take a while, 
because eventually it's gonna upload and all now go to anyone let it load so once it's done we have our thing right so wherever your mouse looks it's gonna look there only and it do the scroll thing also so on the scroll animations we can uh, uh, do it also i use uh, uh, dora dot run for that uh, if you guys uh, don't know how to use dora dot run just comment below let me know how uh, if you guys want to learn about it i'll be more than happy to teach you guys and uh, that's it guys we are good to go this was all uh, in today's tutorial and uh, to make your life easier, I'll be sharing all these assets links and uh, the website link which we created today in the tutorial. In the des description, you can always go ahead and download it. It'll be totally free for you guys. Or you can uh, uh, follow me on my Instagram. I'll be mentioning it somewhere. And you can DM me if you are having any problem and if you want any sort of asset, I'll be more than happy to help you guys. <laughs> and this is it for uh, uh, today's tutorial. I hope you had fun and you have learned something new. It's going to help you uh, somewhere in your portfolio. And if you think this uh, tutorial was good and you want something like this in future also, please don't forget to subscribe, like and uh, share with your friends. Uh, that's it. That's it. We are good to go. Have a nice day. Cheers. In today's tutorial, I'll teach you how to add this three. Hi everyone. This is happy design. Hi everyone. Okay. Before we jump into the uh, complete tutorial create a visually creative uh, designs along with uh, keeping the memory blah, 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 blah.